Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Name. It's me, Ella. Today I wanted to hop on here and share two projects that I made. Uh, one today and started one yesterday, finished it today. And you probably hear June in the background. <laughs> she's mad that I didn't bring her in here with me. But uh, Daddy's out there, so she's fine. Anyways, my good yarning friend Crystal from Chronically Crocheting sent me an email and she gifted me with two of her new patterns. And I will link them down below if you want to check them out. And one of them she has a video tutorial for. And then they're both also for sale on her Etsy shop. So definitely check them out and check her YouTube channel out if you haven't already. She's amazing and I love watching her. <laughs> and, um, but she sent these to me so I was like, well, I'm going to make them. Because first of all, I loved them anyways. And I had already put them in like my um, favorites on uh, Etsy. <laughs> so that I could get them in eventually, you know. And uh, then she sent them all to me. So first, I, yesterday I started the frog. She has a new frog pat pattern called, I'm pretty sure it's, um, that's my wrong notes. Here it is. Prince sleeps a lot. <laughs> and uh, it's just an adorable little froggy. So I'm going to show them to you. Are you ready? Ta-da! <laughs> I think I messed his eyes up a little. I feel like I should have sewed them a little bit more to the head. But it's okay. So isn't he cute? I did not do the mushroom. There's a mushroom applique. And he also has a crown. Hence Prince. But I just wanted to make a regular frog. So I didn't do that. But I absolutely love his little uh, legs and arms. They are so cute, the way they just kind of dangle there. And I love him so much, he's so cute. So I made him with one of my favorite yarn colors that is discontinued, but it's Red Heart Super Saver Glow Worm. So it's like this bright green color. And I've had some gifted to me from a couple people, different people. And uh, so I used a bunch of that for him, his body. I used the Elf Hook, which is a 3.75. And then his little belly patch is Red Heart Super Saver Bright Yellow. This is some black. And pink that are also red heart. I just never can remember <laughs> the names of the red, the pink one. And then the eye, the white part of the eye is red heart super saver white. And the black and white pupil part <laughs> of his eyes is actually some safety eye, or some felt eyes that my sister made. And it did have like white around it, uh, like the white of the eye. So I just cut it off because <laughs> it was uh, felt. It was easy to cut. And then I did hot glue those on. But the rest of it I sewed on. And I think he's so cute. In her pattern, he has a mushroom on his back and a little uh, crown. I just didn't want to do those. And I just love his little feet. I love his little feet so much. <laughs> He's so cute. I wanted to put some cardboard in the bottom of him, but at the time I was making his body, uh, June was laying like right, practically on top of me asleep, and I didn't want to stop crocheting. And also, I couldn't get up to him and get cardboard, so he doesn't have anything in the bottom of him. But he does still set up. And he will just be sitting around. Uh, June has already played with him a little bit. So if you see any marks on him, it's because she was playing with him earlier. But uh, I just think he's cute as heck. And I just love his little uh, hands and feet. They're so cute. <laughs> I love them. But that's the first pattern. So this is available in her Etsy shop. If you want to check it out, I'll link it below. I just love him. He's so cute. And then the second pattern, this is the one that she made a video tutorial to as well. So I'll link the tutorial. And uh, where you can purchase the PDF if you would rather have it written. I prefer written patterns over tutorials, but I do uh, sometimes watch tutorials if I, like if there's a pattern that I want that's not for sale as a written pattern. But this is her new little uh, patterns, like a fuzz stuck to them. Oh, that might be a hair. <laughs> I might have crocheted a hair into him. Okay, I could just stay there for now. But anyways, ta-da! Look how cute he is. He's a little cat. He can also be a dog. I was thinking it's, it's, uh, Labeled a uh, cat pattern, but it could also be a dog. <laughs> if you just bend the ears down, it looks more like a dog. But um, it is a no-sew pattern. None of this is sewn on. The tail, the legs, the arms, and the ears are all crocheted as you go. I did, I technically stitched on the nose, but you could use a, a safety nose or uh, any other way you like doing it. And then these eyes, again, are hot glued on. There's some that my sister made. They're cute. Oh, they're so cute. But I made him, uh, this is a scrap yarn. I have no idea what it is, but it's just like a brown color. And I just thought he was so cute. I whipped him up super quick. You start at the top and work your way down. <laughs> this one, this frog pattern, I would say is like a beginner friendly. Uh, it does have sewing. So that might be hard for some people who've never made amigurumi. But the, all the stitches are like easy beginner. This one, I would say is a little bit more intermediate beginner, <laughs> if, if that's a thing. Because uh, there's working in the back loops. And then parts where you like move the part that you worked into, well, you work them into the front loops and then you bend it up and you work in the remaining loop. That might be confusing for people who aren't really used to making amigurumis. But like I said, she does have a video, so you could always just watch the video. But I think he's so cute. 
I love him. Jesse's already claimed this. He seen it as soon as it finished, and he said, what is that? And I said, it's a cat. And he said, I want that. <laughs> so this is Jesse's little cat. I, I love the big eyes. <laughs> I thought about doing you know, safety eyes, but I was like, I'm going to use some of the size my sister made. And I think he's cute with the big eyes. He's just so cute. <laughs> His nose is the same as this one's cheeks. There's just a little scrapple I have. But that is the two patterns. She gifted them to me and I whipped them up real quick. I did start the frog yesterday. I finished his whole body yesterday. And I made his legs, the um, eye sockets <laughs> uh, I made yesterday. And then today I, I made the, oh, and I made the cheeks yesterday. All I did today was the yellow and the white of the eye. And then I put them all together today. So he was pretty quick. He was pretty quick make. He's big, but he's quick. And this little thing was less than an hour. <laughs> Very quick little pattern just to whip out. You can make a whole bunch of these and give them to people. Or leave them around as a random act of kindness or anything like that. And he's just so cute. <laughs> but that is the two patterns that I got from my good yarny friend, Crystal. Aren't they cute? This little <laughs> I love these eyes too that my sister makes. She doesn't have them in her shop yet, but she is going to be putting them in her shop eventually. She is working on them. But uh, speaking of my sister's shop, she did add some new stickers. She added some crochet ones. Some more crochet ones, uh, a couple craft ones, I think, and some about reading. And uh, she just added them today. So hop over there and check out her shop. I'll leave it linked below as well. Um, and buy you some stickers if you want them. And uh, she had 19 and then she added 10 more. So she's got 29 prints now, different um, images. <laughs> so definitely go check all these out. I'll leave all the links below and uh, check them out and give everybody some love. If you don't want to buy stickers or buy patterns, just favorite them. And that'll help other people be able to find them when they're searching. Um, that's why you can help show them some support without having to uh, buy anything. But, uh, yeah, so, anyways, that's it. I just want to share that. I gotta go back in there. I meant to make a What to Work on Wednesday video yesterday, but Tuesday night, June slept horribly. She was up every hour and sometimes more than once during the hour. I think she's teething really bad. And it was rough. I mean, her boss was exhausted, exhausted yesterday, and she slept a little bit better last night, but still kind of bad. <laughs> so, I'm hoping that she'll sleep better tonight. We, we shall see, I guess. But I'm going to go in there and find something to work on. i got to clean up the kitchen, and then I'm going to crochet. i got two Pokemon going, and I need to pick up my sweater and start working on it again. What else did I start? Oh, yeah, i got, I got a project for tomorrow. I'm, gonna sh I'm hopefully going to share with you tomorrow uh, for a national holiday. But I haven't even made it yet, so I have to try to make it tonight or in the morning sometime. But anyways, I'm going to hop off here, and I'll see you guys in the video. Bye, guys.